Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Do you want Starbucks? <gasps> the chocolate chip is cute. What is that? You are what you eat. I'm vegan, I guess, because I eat vegan. This is the reason it's so expensive is because it's organic here. This organic pineapple juice. <laughs> Look at this bottle. It has so much labels. They were crazy with the labels. Natalie's organic juice. They're everywhere, but they're pretty good. Oh, it's good. Mm. Oh my god. Look how many labels they put. Look how pretty that Porsche is, too. I actually sit there and read all this stuff. I like reading stuff like that. They gave us two straws. I mean, the total was $45 for two meals, two drinks, and it's totally vegan. Well, it's not, the whole restaurant wasn't vegan, right? I guess this is why it's worth it, I guess. The straws are eco-friendly straws. I'm gonna save these, so do you need straw? No. And then they gave us a lot of napkins, eco-friendly napkins, I guess. These are eco-friendly, biodegradable forks and knives. It came with the vegan butter. Pure maple syrup. They actually give you two, not one. Ooh. This was your sandwich. What was it? Sausage and egg, but vegan. Sausage, egg, vegan sandwich on like some sort of home bread that they make in there. Ooh. Sausage and egg. I think the sausage they just said vegan sausage, but the egg is just eggs. Is pancakes. The two stacks were 12 bucks. Three was 14. So I got oh my god, they're big. Ooh, look at that. Oh. Huge pancakes. Oh my gosh. They're vegan. Nothing special, I guess. Like there's no blueberries or anything, but just I ordered butter. And like the pancakes that you make at home never taste like the ones you buy at the restaurants or diner, right? Don't you think? Oh, oh my gosh. Oh gosh. Pancake. Here we go. Oh my gosh, it's so worth it. Really? <laughs> Oh my god, it's so good.
Where's the syrup? How is it? Blueberry. Powder sugar. Right? It's very mm -hmm. similar, right? Yeah. I just put less sugar than them. <laughs> it's good. It's good? Can you help me? Oh, you got it. <laughs> Is it good? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like the drink though. Very good drink. You recorded this one too? Yeah. It actually tastes like Starbucks. Starbucks? I know, that's what I said. Mm. Oh! oh! Yeah, we have... Oh! oh! <laughs> I mean, that was good. Uh, yeah. You're 6 five. You're 6 now, alright? Yeah. <laughs> favorite part this one or the soft part inside inside Look. Should I put cream on the top too? Mm. 
Popo. 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 Hmm. Let me guess what it is, okay? I smell coconut milk, pink drink, but with toppings of kiwi and dragon fruit. Dragon fruit, kiwi, pink drink. You're like 99% right. 99% right? Yeah. So there's one thing that I'm wrong? No, they're all right, but it's a dragon drink with strawberries and kiwi. What did I say? Can I drink it first? No. Well, maybe this has caffeine though. I don't know. I don't think as much as coffee. I tried to make this at home. I just can't try it. It's so good. I used the free free stores again. We were, I thought we were saving that for a mug. Is this Venti or Trenta? Mm. <sighs> I'm trying to balance my life these days, okay? I feel like when I was like you know, in the past, I was too into my look, like looking too perfect. My eyebrows, my makeup had to be perfect, you know, the shadow and everything. And then, and I let go. I let go up to a point where people start to say like, what's wrong with you, you know? I say, who to you? Go your way. I kind of want to have balance in life. Yeah. Yeah. And this is my balanced look. Look, I don't have that much makeup on. I have a little bit on. But yet, at the same time, I did my hair, I did my self hair, like I didn't spend like, you know what I'm saying, like four or five hundred dollars doing my hair. I literally did this myself. I haven't been in a hair salon in how long, Hungi? You're the living proof. Never went to salon ever since your divorce. Yeah. Oh. Last summer, I felt so overweight and so ugly that I just like wore pajama all, well, we didn't go, nobody went out. But you know what I'm saying? like. I don't want to feel like that this summer. I want to be able to wear like whatever I want to wear, like, you know, dress or whatnot. I feel comfortable in my skin. So anything order for me to do that, I think I kind of have to find balance, you know? So from now on, what? Say now again, now. Now again. From now on. From now on. What? Why do you say now like that? From now. Did you notice that? I don't say now. Yeah, you say now. Say now, now. Now. Good. That sounds so like cowish. Now. Mow. Mow. Meow sounds like a cat. Why does it say now? Like that now. Actually, it's not like now, it's more like now. Yeah. Now. <laughs> you always say like from now on. I don't say the now on. <laughs> Who says that? From now on, I'm going now, now. You say it like that, baby. I don't say it like that. Yeah, you do. You're just being sensitive no. over nothing. No, you, last time you were you were getting really mad at the kids, I think, because they were like. Being... Oh, when I get mad though, I just say like, do this right now. Yeah. Like when kids don't go to bed, they're like, you're you're like what? get to bed right now. I don't, I don't see that. You do it right now. Yeah, next time I'm gonna record you. I don't. Now. I don't see that. I think that. it's. I think it's because you're from Canada. I think it's a Canadian thing. One thing Canadians say that's so weird to me now is when they say, "Oh, sorry." They sort of say, "Sorry." They say, "I'm sorry." Don't they say like instead of shopping bag, they go like shopping bag. <laughs> shopping bag. <laughs> shopping... That, isn't that what they say? No, we say shopping bag. No, you don't. Canadians say bag. Can I yeah. get a bag? Oh, they, they do say that. They say, can I, uh, it's been so long. They say, can I get a bag? Yeah. They, I think they do say that. No, I could be wrong. I'm you know how there are people that could like master other people's like accents? Yeah, I wish I could be good at accents. I'm not good at accents, except I'm so good at Korean accent. I could sound so Korean. Okay, go. Like Korean mothers out there, Korean or mother. Well, you are I, I sometimes think that I should record TikTok doing this because I'm so good. Well, you are Korean mother. Yeah, but I'm saying like really Korean, Korean. Like yeah. Korean, Korean. Like Korean mother. 
like Korean mother speaking like very good English. Like some Korean mother speak very good English, just that the accent very bad. You know. I think Korean people they no. have like your a, accent. They have you, a like a no, no. You accent. No, my you. Korean accent is very good. No, your Korean accent. My no Korean accent very good. Your Korean accent no good. Your Korean accent don't sound Korean enough. My accent is Korean. No. Then Kore what is it? Your Korean accent sound like like American person trying to sound Korean person. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Korean accent sounds like Korean person talking English. That's what I sound like. Exactly, but me, I sound very, very much like a Korean mother. Been here for 20 years, speak good English with their kids, but accent very bad. They just can't pick accent. That's what I sound like. I'm so proud. I do my own nails now. I do my own See, hair you just now. said now. I did now. Yeah, roll it back. Roll it back. We not rolling anything back. It's okay to say it like that. I don't care. I'm just saying like you what? say it like that. I'm just no, you saying. You say it. You, you tell me that because it bothers you somehow. No, it doesn't bother me. I'm just letting you know. Wait, when you first met me, did I have a Korean accent? No. I definitely don't sound like American that I know. Yeah. What do I sound like then? I do have an accent, right? My, okay, I I do admit my grammar sucks, okay? My grammar is not that good. You sound like you're from Philly. Well, I'm trying to figure out where the nail comes from. There has to be some kind of accent. It came from my cat. Literally, I could sound <laughs> like a cat. You really say it? Yeah, like, go. Look, okay, this is when my, when my cat was hungry, okay? She was like this. She's like... <laughs> and she's hungry, right? When she's tired, but like, you know, I try to like kiss her. And she gets angry a little bit. Like, stop annoying me, right? She's like this. <laughs> And this is right before she gets really mad, like, leave me alone. She's like this. <laughs> yeah, how do you make that noise? And this is when she's like sad. And when she's mad and she's crying, annoying you, she's like this. Okay, you're annoying me. You're annoying me. You're annoying me. <laughs> but I don't know how to imitate dog yet. Dog? Yeah. What do you mean you don't know how to imitate dog? Like bark. I don't know how to bark like a dog. Unless it's just woof woof. You know? <laughs> like woof. Dog dogs are paid is pretty good. One time Pay didn't paid and barked and I thought it was one oh, of really? the dogs. <laughs> I wonder why Americans say woof woof when Koreans say mong mong. They say mong mong. Mong 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 mong. They say mong mong. <laughs> Koreans say mong mong. Yeah. Mong mong. And even for for uh, for cats, you know here they say meow. Mm -hmm. But in Korea it's yao. 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 Oh my god, that does sound a little bit like cat. Yao. Yao. Why are you keep on dripping? Are you have a problem? <laughs> <laughs> Every time you say you're dripping! Look, you dripped it over here! I gotta lick it now! 